Hey, what's going on guys? Um, today I'm going to show you how to make a template for a phone grip. Um, the phone grips are usually an inch and a half. So we're going to start a new document and make it two and a half by two and a half. So this is a two and a half by two and a half square. So we have to take one inch off of this square on both sides so grab a guideline and put it on half an inch grab another half line put it on the other half inch and we do the same thing to the vertical um, guidelines so that leaves us with a inch and a half square so now we go to layers and make a new layer and we go to our elliptical tool ellipse tool actually we go to the corner here hold shift make a circle inside of our square it's a little bit off you can adjust it so now we go to layers our background layers lock we unlock it and we get rid of that so now this is our template uh, we could go to the layers menu go to rasterize and rasterize layer and that um, makes this a regular object so now we want to put our image on top of this so let's bring our image we put it on top we adjust the size so we can bring down the opacity of this image so we can see our circle on the back and then we can move this image and put it wherever we want it I think it looks good there so now we go to our ellipse layer I can enter actually Go to our lips layer, then go to our magic wand tool, click the layer, and now it has selected the circle. We go to our image layer, and we're gonna hit delete. And it's basically gonna delete everything outside of that circle. So now it deleted everything outside of the circle now we hit ctrl d to release the selection we go to our layer again our image layer and bring up the opacity and there it is now all we have to do is uh, print it on our sublimation printer and make sure we mirror it and it's ready to go ready to be sublimated and now let's say you want to do another pop with a different image you just follow the same steps and now you have this as a template now you can just put your image over this and follow the same steps i did with this one and that's pretty much it guys hope you guys learned something and uh if you did leave a comment a like make sure you subscribe till next time guys